Hello, it's Jibba Queen, and it is Tuesday, December 6th, and I am doing a review on this steam iron. Here it is. There's the plate in the front. It has a blue uh, type of cellophane on, on it, uh, so remember to remove that before you uh, do anything. And here is where I place the water. And the water that I used, it says to use purified uh, or distilled when I iron, which is very rarely, that's why I got this, I use distilled water. And I drink purified water, so, uh, but that's what the directions say, otherwise distilled. Uh, this is the cup, comes with it, and that you pour, this comes off, and you pour it in here. And that's the quantity of it that fills it up. Now we'll see if this keeps a tight seal. Because I feel like it's dripped a little bit. So I don't know what that's about. However, okay, that's on there. And here's the button. This is what I will press when... I'm steaming. I haven't tried this yet, so it's my first time. I read the directions and put the plug in and said, okay, let's test this bad boy with a video. All right, so I am now going to plug this in. All right, and then because I had already plugged it in, it says that the light uh, indicator is red. Uh, the machine enters into preheating stage after a period of time. The light turns green and the preheating is completed. So I am already completed because right before this, I did plug it in to make sure that it did start. So let's see. So here's some pants that are very wrinkly. Uh, let's see. Oh, I see. Okay. I didn't realize I was supposed to touch the pants. Can you all see this? Wow. 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 Yeah, this, this beats, well, this is pretty hot. This beats ironing any day. And now I see why they gave, they gave an oven glove that I'm not wearing, that I should be wearing because the steam comes out on, on this for sure. Okay, so, okay, it's doing, it's doing, so it's like an iron for anybody that's never used one of these, such as myself. I didn't know what to expect actually. Uh, so I, I'm seeing what it's doing. It's like an iron, except that you're ironing horizontally. I mean, uh, vertically, not horizontally. And okay. So you got to keep your finger pressed on this. Can you see the steam coming out? All right, it definitely takes out the wrinkles. I like it. I don't have to take out an ironing board and do this. I can just hang it up here in my garage and do it. That takes care of an example of that. Let's see this shirt now. I got it, I got it, okay. Wow, I got my hand on the outside of this, and this steam is pretty strong coming out of there. Oh, this is fabulous. This is so fabulous. Yeah, this is my new way of ironing. Mm -hmm. This is wonderful. All right, um, we've got a pair of jeans. Let's try this material and see how this does. 
I think I was going too fast. Okay, so it makes sense to just go slow. Yep, that's the trick. Just go slow over your wrinkles. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, this definitely works. Okay, I'm very satisfied with it working. There we go. I don't don't put it towards your face. <laughs> you know, the only suggestion that I would make or that I would like to see is if this button wasn't where it was. And because there is no on off switch, it's just an on switch. So you have to unplug it to, uh, you have to unplug it in order for it to stop. And then it says that if it is, uh, Empty, it will turn red here. So there you have it. There you have it. I am pretty happy with the level of ironing that this does. Oh yeah, this is gonna make my life uh, much easier with now actually wanting to iron. <laughs> I'm good with that. Yeah, I sure am. All right, may this be helpful to everyone and make it a great day. So here I've got this garment steamer. Um, it's not professional grade, that's for sure. This is meant for travel. You can turn it on and off here. So right now it's flashing red. So I'm going to turn it on. Uh, no, okay. Oh, <laughs> got it. Face full of steam there. All right, so I've also let it, I don't know if you can see the steam. So you see just by turning it on, because I've let it warm up, there's a good bit of steam that's coming out. Now you need to fill, but see, there's so much water coming out that if this were not cotton and this were silk, this would be ruined. But the good thing about this type of steamer is that also if you have um, uh, clothes that are uh, dry clean only, this is a good way to freshen them up without having to put them in the washer or giving them to the dry cleaner. And, uh, you know, when you have both hands, you can also make uh, certain seams, if you will. So you can also use it this way, but then the water gets even worse if you use it that way. So you fill this up with distilled water. Uh, I wouldn't even go with purified water. I would go with distilled water. And um, there's this film that covered it, and uh, it just does not come off cleanly. So, I mean, it's not bad for the price. Um... It's not the best steamer out there that I've run across, but, uh, you know, it gets the job done, as you can see here. So, um, yeah, I mean, it might be worth, if you don't have anything else, it's worth buying. And um, you don't have to carry any salt with you that way. <laughs> and uh, those, the ones where you have to put salt in, uh, can get a little bit messy sometimes. Not from steaming, but from uh, carrying. <laughs>